But you the one I want And you the one I need And you the one I want Yeah, you the one I need But you the one I want And you the one I need And you the one I want Do you know what today is? It's our anniversary Anniversary What's the deal gang? Welcome back, welcome back, welcome back. No no not here right now with me. She uh still asleep, but I'm up here planning this scavenger hunt, man. I think this is about to be actually fun. Where we basically do like a scavenger hunt and I print out, you know, all the clues and I send her on the scavenger hunt around the city and ends at a special destination. Oh, uh, my mom recently bought me this printer the other day. So it came in handy because I'm actually running a little bit behind time. So I didn't have to go nowhere and actually get it printed. So that saved some time, but yeah, I'm in here getting this together. Um, I already talked to Tammy. I already talked to Pam. Um, got the makeup set up for her. Got the hair set up for her. I already got her gift. Um, got gift bags. I'm excited, you know what I'm saying? Because it's another opportunity to show that I can plan, you know? So, waiting on this to finish printing. Oh, it's actually finished printing. So, I got to get this from this printer right here. Probably take y'all along. So I'm gonna start it off once we get downstairs to see now now let me finish getting stuff together and I'll talk to y'all in a little bit and we'll probably also do an intro or she'll do her intro once we get together so I'll see y'all in a little bit okay so I got all the clues it's a total of six clues all printed out thanks to my mama for the printer now it's time to get this scavenger hunt started first clue this on the back of her hairbrush you won't need this today because I already booked your appointment ask your chauffeur which is me to take you to the next destination Put it on the back of her hairbrush. See if she finds it. So, um, I got everything all prepared. My baby finally up. Are you ready for today? So I'm tired. So. I already told him hey and everything. Yeah. I already told him hey. I'm waking up, but hey, yo, it's our four-year anniversary. Did you already go into detail about that or no? No, but... I kind of left stuff out. Okay, so our four-year anniversary was April 5th. It's currently April 10th. Our actual anniversary, we just spent the like in private, at home, more intimate. Cause y'all grew up in stress and mom is straight birthdays in three days. I just been having a lot of stress on me, and Zay seen that, so he was like to take a little stress off me, like we could just celebrate our anniversary to ourselves and then like do the actual like you know celebrating either days after our anniversary or like after mom and birthday but we decided that we we're just gonna go ahead and do it our actual anniversary day was really really fun though it was mm -hmm. just between us we watched movies all day drank hella wine <laughs> just vibed it was really fun so today is the actual celebration of making it to four years last year i planned our anniversary like just like the little events we did we went to the movies we went to charlotte to this restaurant like a steakhouse we got a hotel room we stayed out there so zay was in charge of planning our anniversary this year and he looked excited <laughs> yeah i'm excited are you ready for this yeah i'm excited Okay, so make sure y'all like, comment, share, subscribe. And follow us on Instagram at Zay Primo. Follow my baby at bad99 underscore. And um, go ahead to the bathroom door for your first clue to your adventure today. So let's go. Intro. Good morning, beautiful. I know you don't play about your skincare. So spend the next hour or so in the bathroom finding out the next clue to this anniversary scavenger hunt. To <laughs> what? So basically freshen up, but it's another clue in here. Yeah. Where the hell would it be? It would be in my stuff. My stuff a mess. Am I blind? Like is the clue somewhere where I don't see it? Mm, yeah. You gotta look through stuff. You ain't even looking through. You just looking. Like you would normally do, like get all your stuff that you would get if you had to get ready. Don't mind it, it's kind of junky down here. Yeah, don't show them that. It's yeah. in your stuff. To do my skincare, I do this right here. And I just get in the shower, I brush my teeth. Just look through, look at, look through everything that you, that you, your everyday products that you use. Not skin. That you a hint. Contacts? Nope, keep looking. Go down in the cabinet. <laughs> this? Yes. I don't use nothing down here. Nothing at all down there. 
my brush when I do my hair. I don't do that till after the shower, that's why. Clue number one, you won't need this today because I already put your appointment. Actually, your chauff chauffeur. <laughs> chauffeur, which is me, to take you to the next destination. Hair appointment. This is exciting. <laughs> so I need a freshen up first. Yeah. All right, y'all. Y'all girl looking crazy. But hopefully we're glowing up throughout this process. But y'all girl about to quickly shower. Since he says a hair appointment, I just pretty much just gotta wash my hair, do my skincare, and freshen my body up. I'm excited. Like I said, Zay is in charge of planning our anniversary this year. And it look like my boy's starting off with a bang. So, yep. I'm thinking hair appointments probably like with Tammy or somebody. So, yep. I'm about to shower and then I'm gonna check in with y'all. All right, y'all. So, your girl is freshened up after clue one. My hair freshly washed. I just got on this little set. We stopped by to get a little Starbucks as breakfast and the hair. So now we are at Tammy House, which is um, who helped me plan this video. So uh, shout out to Tammy for the help because I was having a hard time. I ain't gonna lie. Like with the riddles, I was having a hard time. So we at Tammy House, about to get your hair done. Um, maybe you'll find your next clue. Oh, so the next clue is at Tammy's. Yeah. All right, y'all. So we're about to go into Tammy's, the baddest studio, and get this hair right. All right, y'all. Tammy. What's my next clue? <laughs> he said I can't get it till after I get my hair done. So what hairstyle we doing? No, I ain't been guessing. Just been going with the flow. We're going with a regular pony and then we're gonna do some flips. And her like a pony unicorn. At the end, cause she likes flips. I'm trying to think if I wanna do something right here in front. No bangs. Yeah. But she don't really like heat, so that's what I'm thinking about. Yeah, let's be doing on low. But like y'all heard Zay like said, Tammy helped him plan. So she already know what's going on. <laughs> and I'm just lost. lost Have you been seeing like when they be having like this slip back and then like this be a little in the front right here? Not that like kind of like a little hump. Yeah, it's kind of like no, a little No, I've never hump. seen I haven't seen it. So yeah, we get a hair done. After I get my hair done, I get my next clue from Tammy, I guess. I got on my little set from the forever 21 and juicy collabs i bought me these i guess i'm gonna show you the process of getting my hair done She gonna look over here and see the next clue. Clue number two. Now that your hair is fleeked, it's time for you to get that face beat. Go see Pam and she'll have your next clue for you. Okay, I look dead. All right, so now the hair is all done. You found your next clue. 
now we're here for you to see Pam because you I've been hearing you all day say oh my face oh, no. I'm breaking out right now I think it's from stress yes yeah, since I know that you're breaking out and you're stressed out this is to get your makeup done because you want to keep talking about how your face look so so I don't know what color to get just get something that's like a neutral color that you can wear with like natural yeah all right y'all so I'm about to go in here and get this face together and you about to go home, right? Yeah, I'll be at the house. I'll talk to y'all when I get home. Bye. All right, y'all. I'm in here trying to look for the clue because Pam went downstairs real quick. I don't see nothing. So I guess Pam probably going to give it to me after I'm done. I was trying to be nosy and peek. But yeah, it ain't no clue out. So I guess I'm going to get it after. I don't know what's the next clue after makeup, to be honest. So yeah. <laughs> They seated to grab a number four for the four year anniversary and to grab some white balloons, but the helium machine isn't working, so I got to go to public and see if they can blow it up. So that's where I'm on the way to right now. Um, hopefully, they can blow them up so I can just put some balloons and a number four in the room so she could just have some decoration. And then uh, I go to the house, put it in there, put the gifts in there, and then well, the clue that Pam has leads her to her closet room. So We'll see you. I'll see y'all once I get back to the house. So Tammy gave me an idea. I had to hurry up and print this off. Um, she gave me basically um, an ice cream card because she wants to come to this this place right here where she used to go when she was younger to get ice cream. So I'm gonna go in here and get the lady the um, the next clue and pay for the ice cream so she can just walk in here and get it. I'm yeah. So, so she didn't find the clue. So. Um, <laughs> behind the chair the whole time y'all yeah i didn't think to look behind the chair Sorry, come here. it was literally clipped on the chair clue number three. Oh my god look at how beautiful you are since you look like a snack let's stop by to get you a snack oh <laughs> all right y'all so we had to make up in the car where are we going to get a snack oh, this is for you i hope it is what i'm thinking in my head I could choose anywhere I want, basically. Um, no, I got some more for you already. A snack for a snack. One ticket for my beautiful girl. Where you get all this stuff from? Secret Helper. A secret Helper? Yeah. Oh, Tammy. Yeah, this looks extra like Tammy. So, we're going to get a snack. I really don't like many snacks. You want me to guess or no? I think I know where we're going. My favorite snack? Broad ice cream. Got another surprise. Oh, something else? Yeah. Okay, I don't know, Daniel. Oh, is it the ice cream shop right here? Bruh, on everything before we was about to pull up to Pam, I was gonna tell you, can we stop by and get some lemon ice cream? We used to come to this ice cream shop all the time, but I'm like, we was already running a little behind, so I didn't wanna have Pam waiting. But my uncle, my mom, we used to always come to this ice cream shop and I always used to get the lemon one. It's so good. I feel cute. cute. I just need my eyebrows done, so my eyebrows might look a little thicker, y'all. But I'm not gonna get them done till like, a day before my mom's birthday, so yeah. She had to make it do what it do. But they look bush. They was bushy before we went in there. So you go in and you have person that ticket. Hold on, you don't got the ice cream people involved? Come on. <laughs> so 
So I forgot to record. Um, the lady giving her her ice cream and the next clue. Now that you've had your snack, you probably messed up your lip gloss. So head to the room where you get flying. You may find another surprise. My closet room. I think it's <laughs> my favorite lip gloss. Bro, what did you do? Oh, is this a four? Yeah. This is so cute. And red. Oh my god. Two gifts. This is too cute. We need to take some pictures with that. Which one you want to open for? It's up to you. Open the bag. Nervous. I love me some skin. I can open it. Yeah. Can't open it. Uh -oh. I don't know how to act. It's that new skins. What size are you getting me? Small. Cute. I can open it just like a little struggle. A lot of struggle. What you know about that skins? And you don't never get hoodies. Actual pullover hoodies. So I, I made you get one. It's cute. I love some skins. That's my favorite thing to lounge in. What do you think that is? I'm trying to take the ball off and cheat. It's a gray box. I love how you put the ball right there to cover yeah, it. Yeah, because you wouldn't know what it is if you don't have that. Some Ricky. Oh my God. This is fire. Oh my God. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. I got three. Look at that. Add them to my Ricky collection. Oh my God. These is so cute. Look at the. That's a bit right there. That's why I got that together. Okay. This is. These hard. I'm ready to step in them. <laughs> what is that? Bruh, look how cute these is. You got to check this something I left on the. um. Where? Look, look at the bottom of the box. Inside? No, outside. Look at the clues. At the bottom of the box. Flip the box. Take the shoe out. Flip the box. Oh my god. I'm obsessed. This is my next clue. Thank you for my Ricks and Skills. Now that you have your gifts, I wasn't. I want. I'm sorry. I want to take you to a place that can either be bitter or sweet depending on your preference. Get dressed and let's go outside to start our evening. Can either be bitter or sweet depending on your preference. I got this. <laughs> That's drink. Yeah. Oh, what, what kind of drinks? Bitter or sweet. I don't know. Bitter or sweet. Wine. Yeah. Oh my God. I'm We're going to a these, wine tasting. These drinks. I'm going to put them on. Let me try them on. <laughs> All right, y'all. So the wine, the Zay picked the wine tasting place that opens at four, but they close at six. But he didn't peep that it closed at six because he didn't think they closed like two hours as soon as they open. So for some reason, all the wine tasting places today are closed on a Monday. I don't know. I guess they don't open on a Monday. I've been wine tasting before, so it's like it's cool. I never been with Zay, so it would have been a little different. But we're just gonna actually go like to probably any kind of bar and just grab like a cup or two of wine or whatever. We're not gonna let that stop the show. So for wine, I know you kind of like wear little dresses and kind of like a little dressed up. I got this outfit that I've been having for years that I've been wanting to wear. I will put it on for my uncle's birthday, but I don't like the way it looked because it's something different. It's not something that I usually will wear. So we're about to try again because maybe it will look different since I have my makeup and hair done today. And it's just like a shirt that's a button up and it's like a mini skirt. And I was gonna wear it with like these white little heels I got. Kinda little heels, sandals. I don't know, like I said, I don't really have a lot of dresses up clothes like dress and stuff like if we have like a special thing going on um i'll usually just order a dress for it which zay ain't telling me to order one so i didn't order one because i thought he was gonna um have it all planned out because he said he was doing a scavenger hunt but he probably assumed i just had all types of stuff in my closet so we're gonna see if this works if not i would just probably put on a regular dress i was thinking should i wear the skims he got me with the ricks but i'm like that's not even wine tasting but we're not going actually wine tasting now so I don't know. If I don't like the way this look, I might throw on the little set he got me. But then again, that's not giving an anniversary, so I don't know. So it's that. And let me grab the shoes I'm talking about. It's like these little white, I guess you could say they some little heels, but they're like really comfortable and easy to walk in. So I'm about to put that on real quick and see what it's giving. I don't know what Zay wearing. 
even to match his flow. But so far, y'all girl is feeling like I'm in the movies. Y'all know where they be doing this type of stuff in the movies. I just been cheesing all day. I do got a few um gifts as well for Zay, so I'll probably do that later whenever he's done with his stuff. So yeah, let me put this outfit on and I'll show y'all. All right, y'all. So I put the outfit on. The only thing is like it's a la la you know risky i was trying to like clip it with a little safety pin where it's like not too much but they talk about that it looks good like that like showing a little skin i don't know this is the little shoes and then just a white tail fur bag and then i'm like supposedly showing a little cleavage but it's not staying i added a little ring i added some hoops i got an anklet on so i don't know i'm gonna insert the picture when i have tried this outfit on with the curly hair and it was not given so is it me or certain like outfits be needing certain hairstyles and uh, maybe the makeup is what's adding a little not making it look bad i don't know this is a little out of my comfort zone i don't really wear stuff like this but i feel like the split is making it like a little more me it's just like i don't know if it's gonna be too much as far as like i don't know where we're going so yeah i'm just wearing my chanel everywhere like it smells good so let me show y'all full excuse the little mess <laughs> that's from the stuff i just opened so do y'all like it? This actually from Six Brian. I think I got this like maybe two, three years ago, to be honest. It's just been sitting in my closet. So it's gonna have to do, y'all. Zay said he like it. I feel like it's just different, so I'm ready. I'm not really sure what bar we're gonna go to or like what little spot to grab some little wine. But once Zay is done getting dressed, I will we'll most likely show y'all his fit as well so yeah i'm ready for the next clue this is isaiah's fit yeah some simple turtleneck you're okay with a turtleneck on yeah thank you baby <laughs> what shoes um some off whites they're downstairs i really got too many pair of dress shoes so. we kind of matching or not with the white or not <laughs> i mean you just got white and blue and i got white and gray we look like a little dressed up so these are little fits we're about to go to like i guess any random spot to get wine though say deuces so we made it to lane we actually been here before yeah, I was gonna say. Yeah, yeah we've been, we've been here, here once. once i think you chose it one time for date night yeah so but we never came back but we just gonna grab wine maybe love appetizer or something yeah we never ate i mean we ate here we didn't drink here though yeah, the first time here. were you 21 that time mm -hmm. i don't you sure i've always been grown <laughs> man all right y'all so we at ryan's got my beautiful date over there looking beautiful just the vibe in here like i said we've been here before so we just don't remember what we couldn't have like the food because we ain't been here since the first time we came <laughs> so now that we like the food it looks very great in here though like the atmosphere and everything is good but i don't think we like the food and now that i'm thinking about it i kind of remember that we kind of didn't like the food well, not that it was like nasty but it wasn't like somewhere where we can and it's a little expensive too so we like we're not about to come and buy some food that's not all that good so but yeah so We'll see y'all. We ordered a bottle, half bottle of. Yeah, they don't sell wine by the glass. They sell a half bottle. So we ordered a half bottle of Ris Riscato or Moscato? I think she said Moscato. Moscato. So. Have red yeah, and they don't got red wine. So we drinking white red, red wine. Sweet. Red sweet. They got red, red wine, but they got red bitter. So we drinking uh, white sweet, right? Yeah, we got a little appetizer. Yeah, we got an appetizer, so. We'll see y'all in a little bit. All right, y'all. This is the bottle. The half bottle. She had me try before she fully poured it, but it's really good. It's, like, really sweet. Cheers to four years. Try it. It's, like, really, really sweet. Damn, that's good. How much yeah, percent, though? Oh, it only got six, though. That might not do nothing to us. <laughs> okay. So, Miss Ma'am wants her next clue. So, here you go. Clue number six. I know after all this time, you probably worked up an appetite. Head to our spot to fulfill your hunger. Your next clue will come to you. We get some salad. Baby trying the crab cake. I don't think I ever had crab cake. And I, I actually like crab. It's hot. Mm. 
good. Hey y'all, so we left Ryan's. We got that wine. Six percent though, it ain't do nothing. Not a damn thing. I'm still at a zero point two. Cause when I first started drinking wine, we used to drink Stella. Like five percent. That shit don't do nothing to you. Be a waste of money, waste of drinking. We found this new wine though that's sweet and it got a little high percentage, so it give you a buzz and it's like good. So we'll put it on the screen for y'all. If you find it, <laughs> nah, I mean, you I could just find it to show her. Well, yeah, uh, I'll find it still though. I'll put a picture on it. We going to Village. We love the sound. We're from there. When was the first time you ever tried them? I know Claudia put me on. She was like, they sounded really good. And I tried it, but then I don't know when we went together so and we tried it. We used to go to Firebirds at first. I feel like Firebirds food ain't all that. Yeah. They wings decent. So uh, I really don't I remember know. our first time we tried it together. But ever since then, we always like going to Village because of the salmon. And then they got strawberry lemon drops. Yeah, when did it become our spot, though? Because when we at one point we just started saying gonna go to our spot like, yeah i don't know when it became our spot uh, but it's our spot now so yep how you feel about um four years um i feel like it's been a, a journey in the beginning we had the ups and then once we started living together like it was a little bit of down just a little bit just because it's just like you, you get to get learn to the yeah. person and yeah. it wasn't like nothing bad it just yeah. was like I understand. Don't be like um you know if you'll be giving shout outs to their um boyfriends or girlfriends be like we don't have so many downs and i automatically be thinking like cheating nah 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 it wasn't that bad and i just hate when people say that but yeah it was just really just getting to know each other on an everyday basis because when you're in a relationship most of the time like and y'all don't live together you mainly only see the other person when you in a good mood. Not saying the only, but like majority of the time you go see your girlfriend or your boyfriend. Both of y'all are in a good mood. So living together, you get to see the person on the days that they not in a good mood. And you might be in a good mood and the other person ain't in a good mood or something might happen and you got to learn how to deal with going through something and still living in the same household. So just a learning experience. But after we got over that little curve, you know what I'm saying? I understood her little boundaries and things. Like when she don't want to talk, I understand how to deal with that. And I mean, I don't know what my stuff that I do. <laughs> what stuff? Yeah, I don't know like what, like something that I do that you have to learn that I do. Like to mm. like adjust to. I'll say you're like work having a lead. I say like clean what is the word clingy? Clean clinginess. Yeah, like you like to be up under each other like twenty four seven type when we first started living together. Yeah. But I just feel like when I gotta get stuff done, I don't even know why we started talking like I know how to explain stuff. Nah, just try as best as you could. I really ain't have no motion out here for real. You know what I'm saying? Like, I didn't shoot videos out here. I didn't really have nothing to do with no friends or nothing like that. So, all day to just be like, you know, what you what you doing? You know what I'm saying? Let's watch a movie. Let's do, you know, on some couple booed up type shit. But she had days where she ain't on the booed up vibe where she got work to do. And I just be out here just not like, having nothing to do. So, that's kind of what it was. But then, like, over time, I started to get out of that. I just feel like um, a relationship is more healthy when we have like like a life outside of each other right like you go have fun without me i go have fun without you like not just always 24 7 like definitely go out without each other basically like yeah. have your own life still have your own fun it's not just couple 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 all the time well, yeah explanation i can't believe we made it to four years it don't feel like we've been dating for four years i feel like it's just feels like maybe like two little years the only reason why I feel like four is because I watched the kids grow up. Oh, yeah, because when like, you first met me, yeah, Tizana was a baby. Was, even Jake, he wasn't a baby, but he was little, you know what I'm saying? So it was like watching all the kids grow up. It's like, that's how I noticed, like, how long we actually been together for real. But overall, I, I appreciate it. I, I, I love it. Uh, couldn't ask for nothing better. <laughs> um, I'm glad God sent me two and one. A boyfriend and a best friend because besides him being my boyfriend i know i can come to him for anything i can come to him when i have good news bad news somebody to cry with somebody to laugh with somebody to joke with somebody to be serious with like i just know i can come to you for anything you about to cry no you about to cry no i'm not about to cry 
Yeah, but we already told each other how we felt on our actual anniversary. We spent it in private or whatever. So we just knew we wanted to celebrate it, like actual celebrate it with y'all as well, which is today. I'm loving my little scavenger hunt. I love my shoes, my skims. Um, just the excitement, like I don't know what's coming next. Just the type of stuff I like. This drive seems forever, but we, yeah, we on the way to um, down village. Get our sound beat. Ten minutes away, so we be Ten. Short. Yeah. So we were checking with y'all. Once we make it to village, it's getting a little darker. So we made it to the village. Sunset. We got strawberry lemon drops. We about to record that. I'm right back. So he's calling his mom. <laughs> this dip is a crab dip in the bread. It's so good. Zay can't eat this though, so I'll be eating it for myself. And I'll be eating all the bread. Yeah. Cheers. Find something that's gonna hit. That they hit, make it perfect here. It's hitting. The food is here. Got the tin glazed salmon with the mashed potatoes and sweet potato fries. And I got the tin glazed salmon with the mashed potatoes. Oh, snap. Today has been a long day. I hope you enjoyed your anniversary scavenger hunt. But wait, it's not over yet. Now it's time for you to relax, head home for your final surprise. Say hell you got Home. You like how they just brought that on the plate? Yeah, they just brought it up. I said you ain't read the last two. Your next surprise will come to you. Oh, I ain't, I ain't really. We just got back home. I just came upstairs because usually after we get home, I come up here to take my shoes off and put it back. Zay will probably walk in here and check up on me. But I'm about to get him his gifts. I actually had Karen make that while we was gone. And then this, I got like a little sweet note inside of it. So if he don't walk up here anytime soon, I'm probably just gonna text him to come in my closet room so he can open his gifts up. And then I don't know what the last surprise is, y'all. And we ain't take no pictures, so I'll probably have Karen take some pictures of us with our little four balloon. But I wanted to get him some flowers because they say, it's a saying like, man, don't get their first flowers until their funeral. So I wanna give him his flowers while he's still here. And yeah, boys deserve flowers as well. Cause like they say, they don't get their first flowers until they funerals. And if you think about it, like that's just sad. So I'm making sure to give moms his while he's here. Yeah, hopefully he like it. And I just added like a little touch of him. If you know, Zay loves hat. I'm feeling a little tipsy out the lemon drops. I'm gonna have to wait on him to walk up here. You got me roses? Yeah, because they say men don't get their first flowers until their funeral. So I want to give you your flowers while you're still here. Nah, that's crazy. I never got roses in my life. So this your first time? Yeah. You know I had to add a little touch of you with the hat. That nah, cute. With the black and nudish. This your first time for getting some? I don't even know how to feel. <laughs> that's what I'm saying. It's like not normal for... You know, boys to get them because they don't get their first to like their funeral. So, that's all right. I like that. That's a good girl. <laughs> that's all right. I fuck with that. Thank you. Yeah, that's all right. Open that box. What you got? I know this off white. Thanks for walking into my life four years ago today. I like that. You always putting a little <laughs> go good on the go. <laughs> What is it? Off white dunks. These fire. No cute. Yeah, you did your thing. Thank you, baby. <laughs> you like? Yeah. The roses, this, like, that's, that's crazy as a rose. Cause I ain't never got a rose before. Them like the um new style that done dropped the, the off white version. Y'all know I always get him something fly. Yeah, they fit perfect. Did your thing. She got me some flowers. She said men don't get their flowers until their funeral. Aww. <laughs> That's so sweet. And then she got me this hat right here. And then she got me these off-white dunks. 
Yeah, show her the note. Just the note first. Wait, thanks for walking in my life four years ago. Oh, that was crazy. Nice to do oh, off white dunks. Oh, no, what? Off white, yeah, dunks. Them was cold. What did you say, 1985? Mm, yeah. Yeah. That's, man, that was sweet. That's great. All right, you can walk in. So this is what y'all missed the other night. Yeah, so I wanted this, to recreate it for you. That's what we did the other night. That's cute with the heart. Yeah. Watch some more movies and relax and chill. Give you a massage. My favorite thing to do. So, end it like this. It's hard to. Hey, y'all. So, I changed into some little scams to get more comfortable. So, they actually went to the store to get wine and some snacks or whatever for our little movie relax time. So, this is actually what we did on our um, real anniversary, which was probably one of my favorites. Even though it was so chill, like that's just me. It was like one of my favorites. We watched like three to four movies. We got wine drunk, had some good food. It was thinking like some homemade tacos. And then at the end, we just like vibe to music, like karaoke type vibe. It was just like probably one of my favorites. Anniversary, even though it was just like chill or whatever, it was like my favorite. And I think tomorrow we're gonna do the wine tasting because Zay was really like mad that we didn't get to go or whatever because he really wanted to do that. We actually never been together like i told y'all earlier so yeah tomorrow's just gonna be like about him because like i said this year was for him to plan our anniversary and i didn't know that he was gonna like just cater to me which is like it's both of our anniversaries so it's supposed to be about both of us but I feel like the actual day that we did celebrate, it was like about both of us. But I feel like the real celebration, he like did it about me, which he just told me like a few days ago that it was going to be a scavenger hunt. But I know it was going to be all about like me. So tomorrow we're just going to do stuff he want to do. I know I want to make him some breakfast. He's like really in love with Fruity Pebbles. So I seen these Fruity Pebble pancakes on TikTok that I want to make. And y'all know I'm not really a cook, so I want to make him some breakfast and cook for him and hopefully they come out good i actually know how to make pancakes cameron taught me how to so it shouldn't be that hard you just sprinkle the little fruity petals on top and then we can do the wine tasting because he really wanted to do that today has been amazing i feel like usually i'm the one that's extra and plans extra stuff and zay is more so like on the chill side but today he beat me at my own game like i feel like he was the one that was extra this year and i was the one that was like more so chill he beat me at my own game let me find out he's taking notes because it's usually me that's always extra always doing the most and he beat me at my own game y'all so he been taking notes but he definitely surprised me it was unexpected like this was something that i would have done and like i said he beat me at my own game which i love that for me i just got to be the chill one and not do too much and let him do all the extra stuff so I love that for me. So our anniversary has been amazing. We got double celebration. We're going to have triple celebration. But four years, that's really big. So we're going to do all the celebrating we want to do because it's just like, this is my longest relationship and this is also his longest relationship. So I love that for both of us. We made it and I can't wait to make it to many more anniversaries. I love that I get to do it with my best friend. I wouldn't want to do it with nobody else. And we're just both lucky to have each other, to be honest. So, yeah, I'm probably talking y'all head off because I'm a little tipsy. But, yeah, I just wanted to update y'all as I went to get wine and snacks. And it turned into a whole nother session. So, let me leave y'all alone, y'all. Bye. I'm going to see y'all when Zay get back. All right, y'all. Zay back. This is the wine that we were telling y'all about earlier, by the way. It's really good. Sweet. Where's the percentage at? It got 9.5. But baby, it gives you a buzz. So go try it. And we're watching this movie that Zay picked out called Date Night. And that's what it's about. Probably gonna have to wipe my makeup off, take my contacts off, wrap my hair before I get too comfortable. This ponytail a little uncomfortable to um lay back on. So I gotta lay to the side. Cause I'm gonna keep it until tomorrow. But cheers. We can't get too wine drunk because we gotta go to the gym tomorrow. 
Way better than the other one. The white one? It was good though. But this one like got a, like a kick to it and sweet. Yeah, play the movie. So, I mean, I can just snatch my lashes off right now. That'd be the best feeling when you snatch your lashes off. Mm. My earrings. Back to being ugly. I think I done ran out of my um little water to wipe my makeup off. Mm. So, our movie is starting. <laughs> Beach. Um, get ready with me. My contacts going in the trash because I already don't wore these for three weeks. So that's good. So yeah, y'all, we about to drink wine, watch this movie, and we gonna most likely see them tomorrow, huh? Okay. Yes. Good night. Good morning, y'all. So like I told y'all today we're gonna be catering to zay so the wine tasting he really wanted to do that yesterday um so we're gonna go i'm gonna treat him to the spot me and my sister's been before it's like a 20 minute drive it's not in winston but it's just like a 20 minute drive um it was pretty fun so i'm excited to do it with him and like i told you i'm gonna make breakfast we didn't wake up for the gym um we stayed up late watching movies and stuff so i don't even know why we thought we were about to wake up so yeah it's already a little later we did wake up a little later but he's in his gaming room which is upstairs so i wanted to do breakfast in bed but since he's already up i'm just gonna do like a cute little setup on our breakfast table probably like some rose petals with the breakfast that type of vibe pray for me because y'all know i don't really be in the kitchen but i'm about to cook for zay so it's some fruity pebble pancakes he is in love with like Fruity Pebble cookies. I think when we was in Atlanta, he done had Fruity Pebble French toast. Like he just loves Fruity Pebble. So I had seen the pancakes and I thought it was perfect. I'm gonna also fix a mimosa. I got some little um, bubbly on my bar cart. So I'm gonna do that. I got the orange juice, strawberries. We got turkey, meat. So Zay only can eat the pancakes that you do with water, I believe. But this one says milk. So I know I'm gonna have to do my protein pancakes. We usually been doing the protein pancakes, but like they're good, but it's just like kind of settling for, you know, a healthy option. So I was just gonna do regular cause um, our trainer do be like on special occasion, you know, you're able to eat what you want cause it's a special occasion and it's our anniversary. So I don't know. I might have to go get another one. Then eggs, of course. We only got four little eggs. We got All right, let me figure out this pancake stuff. Hey y'all, so we had to get some of the pancake mix with water delivered. I think this used to be the Aunt Jemima one, but they changed like the packaging and then some more eggs. So, and then Karen taught me that it's easier to pour it in here so it could be easier to pour. Like I said, we woke up a little late, so it's already 12-ish, it's giving brunch. And the wine tasting closes at five, so we need to hurry up. But the thing is, I suck at multitasking. I'm a little under pressure. All right, I'm gonna go based off the measurement in the back of the thing. It say two cups. And then one and a half cup of water. All right, y'all. Then water. I'm stressing because I don't know how to multitask. Let me turn this one on for my sausages. I know eggs is last because they're quick. I'm going to pour this in here. I think it made too much because I'm not go make me any fruity pebble ones. I don't really like too much sweet stuff. And I know we only eat like two each, so I'm gonna make me regular ones. So hopefully that's enough. So she always be saying the key to making like the pancakes crispy, let me bring it over here. Just to make sure you add butter like every little time. This angle dark, cause I'm filming off the phone. Usually I can show you off the camera. Let's see. Here. We got the windows open. I'm gonna close them so it can be brighter. All right, so I don't know if that's better, but let's get started. First butter, of course. And 
I'm gonna go ahead and put my sausage in. Look, look, look. It looks like I need a flip. Oh. Should be adding butter. So the edges can be crispy. This just be the flipping part, y'all. Pray for me, pray for me, pray for me. It. <laughs> and it look good. So pretty much if you just want them crispy, just keep adding butter. On the low edges. I need to add butter in this pan. It's been getting hot for a minute. Probably a little more. I'm gonna go half a pack for now. I don't love Karen either. This is supposed to be healthy. My paper is probably ready. I'm burning it. Just a few more seconds. This line I'm moving so fast and ain't doing nothing. This one down. My damn butter already drying out. Butter, butter, butter. I pretty much repeat that same step. Y'all, my slow cell. I'm doing pretty terrible. I was supposed to. But. I was supposed to add it while I'm cooking it. I guess that other one will be mine. So I'm basically supposed to. Sprinkle it while it's see there we go. Messing up while it's cooking. There's too much going on. I forget about the main ingredient, like the wood. Alright, so this is what it looked like from the top, y'all. I think I made it too damn big compared to the other ones. Sausages. But look, you gotta put the food in before you flip it. Look kinda cool. My mama pulled up cause she got a, um, a birthday in a few days, so she had to come get the stuff that we did bought for her. So I pulled up and I got the food. Look how much it is. Thank you. 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 Thank so we almost done. Mama Estrella saved me with the eggs. <laughs> so after this, I'm gonna just set it up on the table and try to make it look cute. Do her eggs different. She said it's more delicious like this, so we gonna try it like that. I usually just do scrambled. All right, so I started making the plate. So I like put fruity pebble on top. The person I seen do it, they had like some white like syrup, but I'm not even sure if they can eat that. We just gonna put it on top. Sausage links. I did put like a little um powdered sugar as well. So this is plate. I'm gonna put some rose petals and um put the little sign out that we be putting custom stuff and put like happy four year or whatever. The mimosa cups. I gotta cut the strawberry. I'm not really that hungry. I'm gonna eat two little pancakes. My plate not gonna be cute. My plate, not the main event. <laughs> yeah, so Zay plate is the main attraction. Mom's just ugly. All right. All right, y'all. The bubbly. Ooh. I got two more in case there's not enough, though, to fill it up. It's just the um barefoot bubbly, the pink Moscato one. I'm gonna open another one because these been on my bar since Valentine's. So might as well use them. I don't even know if y'all can see me. Sorry if this me recording this brunch because it's already late. Been all over the place, but that's something I need to work on. I do not know how to multitask. Like it stresses me out. Cause I haven't even cleaned my mess. Cause Karen will be like, you gotta clean as you go. So I'm just do that after we done. 
eating. Then I cut and washed my little strawberry. So now we need to make this area over here cute. So I did my little sign that say happy four years and then light up. Cause he pretty much don't walk in that way. And the rose petals will be reusing them. I'm gonna put these all over the table. The rose petals just give it a pop. All right, y'all, so this is the little final. <laughs> Our plates, the yeah, damn rose petal. I think his look cute. Like I said, don't mind mine. But I think I did pretty good with the fruity pepper ones. Hopefully they taste good, the mimosas, the little rose petals. I got to face him this way because he gonna walk down the stairs and it's just gonna be right there. So I'm about to him to come eat and hopefully he like it and it tastes good. All right, he about to come down. Excuse my mama. <laughs> She waiting on Karen to come down. I think they about to go do something. Dude, why are you cheesing so hard? Yo, childish. What you peep? What I'm yeah. Fruity Pebble. Fruity Pebble. Yeah, you like Fruity Pebble. How you, what made you think of that? What's you like Fruity Pebble cookies and stuff like that? My mom told him you can't cry. <laughs> <laughs> I like that. That's good. All right, so mm -hmm. he said he like. We about the grub. Ain't that the word? Yeah. The Fruity Pebble ones actually look cute. Maybe there's my bar hand girl today. Little Fruity Pebble pancakes? Mm-hmm. <laughs> this is my idea. <laughs> <laughs> Man, that not you know now they got the actual fruity pebble like mix though. They got the the cereal inside the pancakes, the pancake mix. Yeah, we lost all our real forks, yeah. so we gotta use these. Y'all not a goat Y'all both goat. I'm over here stepping out of my comfort zone because I'm not be cooking. I was in there panicking. I don't know how to multitask. That's the thing, because you gotta be cooking three things at a time. You did good. Yeah, she did. Yeah, my mom be getting chased by geese that stay by her house. Oh, how it tastes, it's actual cereal inside of it. And how it tastes, are you good like that though? Yeah, it's so actual it's cereal inside of it. Mm-hmm. Is that what? So it's, it's fruity pebbles inside the pancake mix? Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. So she did it like that. Mm -hmm. I'm about to do some, I'm about to go get some cereal. I'm gonna <laughs> and say I did it first, and y'all talked about me. Yeah. Yeah, it's good though. Hey, what else is it? Stop this egg. Mm-hmm. Hey, mimosa. I'm about to come over here. I don't feel like being here. What you getting when one through? No, they're almost gone already. Hey. They're not like too Well, you like that type of stuff. Yeah. Cheers. they not like too sweet, or that's your type of vibe. No, nah, sometimes they be too sweet. They ain't too sweet. Damn, my mouth to good. My damn strawberry. My pancakes, even though I was stressing, they actually taste good. They yeah, taste good. buttery. Shout out to Karen for teaching me how to make pancakes. You know what I mean, you need to teach me. So the wine place closed at what, five? Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, we're actually carless. Yeah. The Camaro, I don't know what's wrong with it. Car terms. Basically, it just need. Um, it's like some terms like she got to explain. It ain't even like you could just say it's simple like transmission or it ain't the transmission or nothing. But it's basically like the engine ain't like screwed, not screwed all the way in, but basically like it get loose, so it's not like tight as it's supposed to be, and it's causing it to like jerk when we uh like when you take off. Yeah. Come on, yeah. So my mama, old car been over here because she supposedly gave it to Karen, but Karen wanted something newer, so it's just kind of been over here. That's what we've been driving, and it went out yesterday. So now we carless. We're gonna have to Uber to the um wine place because it's 25 minutes away i don't know but after this we're gonna get dressed my hair is already done with the flaps i guess because i slip on it look a little rough but whatever probably just touch up my skin probably, i'm not gonna do no extra makeup did you sip your mama mm -hmm. it looks so full i just ate big of that bite my mom was talking about how it's been four years if tazana is already about to be five and that when you came around tazana was a baby <laughs> i've been knowing you for five birthdays right 
Mm-hmm. But we didn't make it official till April, so that's why I was trying to tell her. But that is a little confusing, though, right? <clears throat> yeah, we've been together for four years, but I've known you for five of your birthdays because we met on your birthday, like when I went. So to does that you. mean we've been together for five years? We've been knowing each other for five. But we we got together the same year that I had the birthday. I've been knowing you for five of your birthdays because when we first met, that's when we met, like on your birthday. Right, but we got to, we made it official that same year. Yeah, so what year was that? April, I'll be forgetting the years and my damn notes. Or have you only known me for four years? I don't know, that is a little confusing. It was 2019. And it's 2023 right now, so yes, it is four years. Okay, so we start, it was 2019 that we started dating. And we met for the first time 2019. Yeah, so you only know four years. But that birthday counts, basically. Like, when we first met, you know, you wouldn't count that. Oh. So, 2019, to make it a year, it would have been... Oh, I get what you're saying. You wouldn't count that, it that been first. It would have been 2020, yeah. 21, 22, 23. Yeah, that's four, but I met you on 2019, so that's why it's five birthdays. Like, right. I've been with you since your 2019 birthday, 2020, 21, 22, 20, that's why it's five. It makes sense. Yeah. We've been knowing each other for... Half a decade. What you about to say? Yeah, I was trying to think of that. Half a decade? So, I guess this food was good because we kind of went in. I don't see how you can eat really really sweet stuff yeah you know you know yeah. the most sweetness i like is like ice cream but not really because i like like regular little flavors not too sweet what you wearing mm -hmm. do you taste the crispy edges yeah you did your thing i don't know how to make pancakes so anybody know how to make pancakes better than me so we just about to enjoy our breakfast and then we're going to start getting ready for wine tasting. Oh, yeah. Wine has been our thing recently because we've just been getting, like, wine drunk instead of any drunk. So, I think, is that why you want to go? Mm-hmm. I'm full. My plate clean. So, yeah, we'll probably see you once we start getting ready for wine tasting. Hey, y'all. So, I'm dressed. I just went with, like, this really matchy-matchy chill fit so this dress zay mom actually gifted it to me my hair my flips ain't really there but oh well i just gotta add some hoops the dress is navy blue i don't know if y'all can tell in the camera and then i got these dunks on oh shit oh shit these um the michigan dunks i've actually never worn them so i was like why not so then i just added the yellow bag like i said matchy matchy chill fit it looks all right. It's not one of the wear like some type of dress, but this should do. Let me show you on the mirror. All right, so this is what it's giving. No extra. I just gotta add some lip gloss on my lips. I just put lip liner and then hoops. I should have told Zay to wear his because I had gifted him the Michigan Dunks, I think, for his birthday. Or well, I don't know when. So we could have twin, but I don't know what he wearing. He's still getting dressed. I got a little deodorant on it. So, yep. Chill was still cute. So yeah, yeah, I'm just waiting on Zay to be done. But we most likely will see y'all um once we head in there or once we there because we run that little behind and we're trying to hurry up. I just wanted to come show y'all my little fit. So yeah, let's go.
right, y'all. So we made it to the vineyard, vineyard, whatever, however you pronounce it. Um, we was running a tad bit late, so uh, we wasn't able to do the the tasting like inside where they, like they describe each wine to you. So they made us not made us, but they told the us that we option, could. Yeah, yeah that they told us that the only option for right now was to do the self tasting, where you get to pick four um, four different flavors of the wine, and then we also want to do the slushies too. So, so yeah. I think they had like red wine and some other stuff. Red, we went, white, and sweet, right? Yeah, we went with the sweet one because y'all know we like sweet. What flavors did you choose? Um, for the what well, for the wine? No, for this, uh, watermelon, black cherry, mango, and strawberry. Yeah, when me and my sisters came, we was just inside. We actually didn't come out here, but it felt good. It's a vibe. It's pretty. We're gonna start with the slushy ones before they melt. Yeah, so we're gonna go peach first. This one. Yeah. Do we taste that at the same time? We got too strong. Good. Strong. come here with these all the time. I don't remember which ones I got with my sisters, but I was more so focused on the regular. Um, the regular wine, not the slushies. Yeah, it's That's good it, though. Bro. Like I ain't never heard of wine slushies. Me either. Well, what kind of? We just had the alcohol slushies. That's the only slushies we had that had something in it, right? All right. What's the next one you want to try? Just go in order. And we got a um. Rate Which one is? from one of like four top and lowest this sun probably bright yo which one is this one it gotta be watermelon that one tastes better than that one what okay. you think oh no we gotta taste it again you tasted it <laughs> they got a little pond over there we might need to go sit over there yeah the watermelon is good that but looks like it, watermelon. This one, no. No, nah, this black, this black, uh, black, black cherry. I think okay. that's black something. That one more sweet or something. I'm gonna give my ratings at the end. They all good. I wonder if they all got the same wine in it though. Mm, I don't think so. That one tastes the same as peach, Bellani. Mm -hmm. What What's the flavors again? <laughs> that one just gave me a brain freeze. What's the flavors you say again? Mango, peach mango. Which one is peach mango? This one. Okay. It was black cherry. We can this look at one the looks like here. black cherry. If you look but at the But she said bottom. she had to go get this one from the back though. Well, she said nice to have black cherry. She brought uh -oh. that out. And it's strawberry and watermelon. So this is either strawberry or, wa or watermelon. Because strawberry and watermelon is pink. All right, so mine's... Oh, you go first because Jason, I feel like you just be trying to say... No, I don't. I think that's the pink one. The pink one. The no, you have to say which one is your top one, second, third, oh. le least. So this, this one, number one. That's number two, number three, and number four. What do you think? What was yours again? One, two, three, four. Okay, mine's is one two three four so kind of the same okay, we gotta she try be trying to copy one. off me we're gonna get blamed for you with we can just try two separate ones mm -hmm. so we're gonna move on to the um the wine the, not the slushy the, the sweet wine flight that one that you have is what muscadine muscadine sweet rose a blend of Carlos and Noble grapes that exhibit both berry and floral aromas along with tropical flavors. Muscadine Sweet Rose is a refreshing sweet wine. Mine's is, mus is they all Muscadine? Mm, yeah, Muscadine. Muscadine Sweet Red. This one is fresh plucked grapes. Aromas fill the nose while homemade strawberry jam plays on the palate in our Muscadine Sweet Red wine. The sweetness of this one is for that one is four you always want to circle it around mm, i don't know how i feel about mine let's see this is sweet <laughs> it don't tangy. taste sweet bro that is not sweet <laughs> i'm scared to try it yours was sweet try it yours is Berry. Mine's a strawberry. 
motherfucking squirrel. <laughs> this is not sweet, bro. Or is our definition of sweet different? That's the other one was sweet we had yesterday. Man. All right, let's go to the next <laughs> one. We still gonna have to drink all this down wine. Okay, so that one that Zay has, or you want to read it? Yeah. Let me see. The one I got is Sunkissed Peach. Sweet white wine blends harm harmoniously. Okay, yeah. With Sunkissed Peach creating a fragrant fresh sipper. The peach one. And then this one. Sunkissed Red Sangria. Um, Properity. Properity. That's the word, right? But. <laughs> yeah, that's a difficult word. Properity Red Blend. Um, natural fruit flavors. Ripened berry and juicy peach bowl. Uh, bo God damn, girl. Y'all got some names on that now. Most substance hints of citrus on the <laughs> so nose. We don't know how to read. Man, they got these they got words. Big words but they ain't even big words. The, it's just like different the words. Sweetness on um, mine's is three. three yours three. is three. So where's the five sweets? So these is less sweeter than the last ones we had. They don't. Yours got a little acidity in their body. What does body mean? I don't know. All right, let's try this we one. We need now. five sweet. This one don't taste bad. It's not that bad, this one. This, this is more the sweet than it. Yeah, that's the best one. This, so, how is this more? It's got less sweet, but it's more sweet. Okay, what's your favorite one out of the sweet flight? This one, then that one. Peach. Then the one I had right here, and then yours last one. Yeah, them first two we had y'all strong. And we gotta finish these in about like 10, 10 minutes, because they're closing. So we're gonna finish this. I don't know why they close so early. Yeah, all the vineyards, vineyards, wineries all close at five and six o'clock. I don't get what the purpose of that is. Maybe because all older people be here and they wake up early. So. so we gotta chug all this stuff. Yeah. It ain't no just sitting here and enjoying it. So let's get the slushies out the way first. So we gotta chug. Um, I'll set y'all up if y'all wanna see it. This sun probably too bright, y'all. They want to do the slushy first. We should have brought some type of little container and take these home. The slushy ones hit though. They do. Compared to the other ones. Have y'all ever heard of um, wine slushies? The first time I came was the first time I ever heard of wine slushies. We should chug one of the ones like just. We gotta do the nasty ones first. I don't know if I can do the nasty ones. Uh, Pass me one. I don't want to do the nasty one. I want that peach one. <laughs> you wanted that one? Man, I'm about it. I ain't got damn brain. Please. Where yours at? We about to chug, yo. They rocking his new hat. They definitely don't. They can't hear us. Y'all, they mowing damn long, so we. I don't know if y'all can hear us. I got my new hat. You feel me? Courtesy of my bae. Come on, let's chug. Which one you chugging? So we can. Ready to chug the next one? We got two minutes. Mm, this How many minutes we one. got? Ten minutes, and we still got these two left. Now I guess we about to be drunk. I'll take the nasty, nasty one. Oh wait, which one is the nasty, nasty one? I think it was that one. How's your wine tasting going so far? It's cool. I mess with it. We gotta come back and do the real one, y'all. It was like 12 rounds. <laughs> we was lit after we left. Yeah, I got the nasty, nasty one. That was the day y'all came back to the house and, get, and did all that crazy stuff. Y'all had all them same outfits on and you had to go get the white juice and get or something like no, that. No, that was Which Tammy's that brunch. Day. That was um, Tammy's brunch that day. Y'all was lit that day too. Yeah, we always doing something. All right, I ain't no pussy. <laughs> I take medicine as a kid just the last two was like more stronger than our liking the first two weren't that bad i hope that they come get your ass at five or you <laughs> <laughs> yeah. got a little five minutes all right so we trying to figure out where this spot is at I'm supposed to be going to get a manicure i can't figure out none of the stuff that i want to do so now i'm not talking about we switching back to her can they even hear you yeah, hopefully this is. I, I think said that's today is about him, and he can't think of nothing he want to do. Bro, it's not a lot of stuff to do out here. So I said a manicure. 
Is that her? Yeah, how you doing? Doing good. Yeah, I parked I park right here. Okay. Ashley, how you doing? I'm kind of a little type of guy. I already doing You don't want to get a pedicure too? Nah, I'll just do that. She just talked me into doing this. <laughs> I'm originally from New York, but somehow. Okay, well, yeah, then. Somehow, I made it here. That's the same way I feel. Somehow, I made it here. It's just seamless have stayed here. Yep, same story. Years. Well, you definitely got to check them out. They're food is awesome. Okay, yeah. But I don't think they're open today. I can't say the Sunday. And then I have a vested interest. My son has a son. Oh, you good. You good. Oh, you good. Oh, you good. Let me see your arm. Like I said, this is coffee. And it has all kind of oils. Um, I do put oils in it. I am big on vitamin E and aloe. Feel me? We at the Den of Kings, you know. Got me feeling like a king. Got my crown. Feeling good. I enjoyed it. The experience was A1. You left your phone in the car? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, so the experience was amazing. Um, well, thank you so much. Got this wonderful woman right here. Den of Kings, y'all come check me out. Make sure y'all come check her out, man. Had a good time in here. All right, so I just left Den of Kings. You know what I'm saying? So it's specifically for men, though, you know. But she also said that she do date nights, too, yeah. though. So we're going to see about the date night, maybe one night, come in, spend some time with her. But it definitely was a vibe. Um, mainly cater to, yeah, man, young man, young kings like myself. You know what I'm saying? I'm a king. That's my queen. You know? <laughs> so, yeah, we, uh, well, I was doing that. Did you figure out something? Or where were you doing the whole time? This is your day. I'm saying that you said you was going to. What you want to do? Like, Go get some, yeah, eat. Get some food from somewhere. We downtown, so we can probably find somewhere down here. I'll let y'all know. All right, so we downtown. New York. <laughs> <laughs> we want to go try some. We can cross. We want to go try some new restaurants. So, uh, well, since we downtown, we want to go try some new restaurants. So we going to a place. You saying restaurant? Let's go to. Oh, uh, like multiple. Uh -huh. Yeah, we want to try a new restaurant. We didn't want to go to the same places. So we're going to some place I don't know how to pronounce, but I wanted to go here because I had to taste for some Mexican food. So it's just carrot. Got it. Got uh, it. Got it. I don't know. Yeah, so. Yeah, that's where we're going. Um, I've been having to taste for some Mexican food. So that's where we're going. We'll see y'all once we get in. This is what it's called right here. I don't know if y'all know how to pronounce that, but I definitely don't. But it's a Mexican grill, so about to see what they hit now. Hopefully, they're good. Right inside my city. 
This is Twin City drink. I ain't know it was this big. They said it was big, but this is this is damn pot. We got the drinks for two. Date drinks. Let's see. We got this drink. I don't know what we got ourselves into. It's huge. Yeah. Yeah, it's good though, so that's probably, it's going to be easy to drink. It's just going to sneak up on you. Yeah, two Corona and liquor. She just ordered some Chordy Queso. That's so good. It's cheese there, but with Chordy soap. I be pissed off that I can't eat the cheese stuff, man. It be looking so good. Like, look at that. I ain't got that much Chordy soap in there. Damn, that looks good. You need to get the chugging. You think we'll be able to finish it? What time? It's 35. Yeah, we'll be able to finish it. We ain't in a rush. So we're just waiting on the food. I got torta cubana. He loves tortas from anywhere. Yeah. But he got um, introduced to it from my aunt. Yeah, she made the homemade ones. The homemade ones, fire. And then it's this truck that we'll be going to fire. So hopefully these ones fire. <laughs> Got my torta. This is a different bread than I'm used to. But what you smiling for? Cause it's gonna be nasty. That don't look like a torta. That don't look like a torta. We gonna see. It might still be good. Video talk. Your tacos look good though. Look alright. Look alright. Let's see what it's hitting for. She talking about like a Jersey Mike's. Uh... Go ahead. I'm ready to see this up. Little like a like a torta bread be different. I don't know. Yeah, and they got beans on it too. Why are you looking at it like that? You like beans? Yeah, what it is. Yeah, be real. Yeah, that's it. But it ain't what you. It ain't. It don't taste like the other stuff. Mm. It's good though. Nah, cause usually when you like something, you be like. Nah, I was like. You always be like that. <laughs> you ain't do that. <laughs> you ain't do that today. That's probably was good, seven And then it's like double tortillas. I'm gonna get double full. It's not a 10, but that was a 10. She wanted to look at it and it's like, like two a, minutes. Like a six. So we'll probably never come here again. It's still, it's still on the menu. Hey, you didn't know, fry like that, Tim. They're good. For the torta. You look sad. <laughs> he was all hyped for his throat stuff. I be trying to tell him that everybody makes certain stuff different. So, seven, six. Ten. The drink ten. Yeah, drink ten. The chili dip thing. What I said, five six. Who buys the color so much? Well, we just rated off like homemade. So is it that fair? Like we rated off my mama's stuff. Man, that's all I know. So I don't know. Yo, Zay looks sad. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I try to eat it, y'all, but I only could eat one. I don't know, this cheese in here, it's like, I don't know. So that's, I just ate one. But we still got this whole damn drink, I don't know what the hell we was thinking. Yeah, this wasn't bad, but it's just like fun. Yeah, the drink is actually good. I don't know how you drink, son. Since we tried it. What was your turn? I don't like eating and drinking, like I'll eat you ain't first. You no more. Yeah, I'll eat first and then drink. <laughs> they sad about his torta. <laughs> I'm gonna send it to my mom. <laughs> this the update on our drink. What you at? You're at a five. You're at a five? I'm at like a two, three, y'all. Yeah, that means you need to drink more. Yeah, I don't really. I mean, we still got more Corona in here. So, yeah, that's the drink update. It look like we haven't got nowhere, though. I drank most of it. You ain't. Yeah, you don't need no more. Tell me no more. I'm at a five. You didn't say I was at a ten. Eight. I'm waiting eight. on you. Go ahead, one. Eight, 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 eight. Yeah, you're drunk. How? Because I just made that face. Because you're dancing. You just told me to dance. <laughs> I'm not helping you this time. That's on you. 
this is not really much. Go ahead with this. This is ain't really much. It give you brain freeze though. So you're done. No, I ain't done. All right, so we just left the restaurant. It was like a five out of 10. The drink was good though. <laughs> so we came to a bar. On a Tuesday, y'all. Cause I didn't want to go in the house It's yet. a bar slash lounge. So we're here. It's Zay Day, so I guess we're here. <laughs> I just didn't want to go in the house yet, so. It ain't that paint like it was the other day, though. So we got Euphoria. This the vibe of the club. There ain't too many people in here right now. Oh, uh, this is a vibe with a bar slash lounge. It's the drinks we got. Lemon drops, they ain't had strawberry. wraps up our four year anniversary. How did you man. enjoy your day? Zay Day. Great, I had a great day for Zay Day. I met me a new person. You know what I'm saying? That, that do my manicures. I won't go to nobody else but her now from now on because she treat me like a king. You know what I'm saying? So Yeah, I feel like that was a really um good the place. Food. Uh, he chose the best place. I mean I tried. He chose that that place. Yeah, I, ch I chose that place, but it wasn't. <laughs> but but overall, overall, I had, a, I had a great time, though, overall. Overall, I enjoyed my scavenger hunt. It was it was like the movies, you know? <laughs> <laughs> the stuff you see in the movies. Yeah. It was exciting. But overall, I'm just glad we made it to four years. Four years with my best friend. Best friend. I want you to run all the time. I want you to buy my cause I'll be your best friend and you'll promise you'll be mine and you'll promise you'll be mine. <laughs> <laughs> we tipsy though, we ain't gonna lie. We done had a long day of drinking while yeah, it's tasting. Been a long day. He was drinking at his manicure. Yeah, I had a beer. I don't even drink beer. I just drank it because she At the restaurant and the bar, so yeah, it's been a little long day of drinking. Yeah. But overall, I enjoyed my anniversary. What about you? Yeah, I enjoyed it. Congratulations to four years for us. 
Big foe. Big foe. <laughs> Yeah. So hopefully y'all enjoyed the anniversary celebration with us. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and share, and, share. and follow us on Instagram at and say Primo and at that not not underscore. And we about to prepare ourselves for Mama Australia celebration. Her birthday is literally in two days. So I'll make sure y'all tune in to not our channel for the celebration. Yeah. So we love y'all so so much, and we will see y'all in our next video. Girl, let's go. I'm gonna go to the lego. True, but true, the one I